Hello everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will be learning how to convert rows to columns. But before we begin, let me tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. So, if you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now without further ado, let's get started with our one point agenda that is how to convert rows to columns in Excel. So for that we might want to get started with our practical mode. Now you can see I'm on my Excel worksheet and I have one table on my worksheet right now. So you can, you know, uh, transposing or, you know, converting rows to columns is a very simple task. I'll explain you in two different ways. So the first way, select all the cells that you have on your sheet and press on control C. So it will give you the copy option and then you can also paste in the same sheet or if you want you can go to a whole new sheet and select the paste option over here but before selecting the actual paste option you can see a small drop down icon click on that and navigate to paste special and in this you can see transpose option click on that or you know make sure that it's checked and press ok now you can see all your columns are been converted into rows and all your rows are converted into columns so this was the first way and uh, what is the second way you ask me so it's really simple select one cell somewhere and you know you can or let's create a new sheet as well so here you can you know write down the formula as transpose and select the array which you want to transpose so this is the array so transpose is basically an array function in Excel. So once you are done with you know, selecting your data, press enter. There you go. So all your rows are now columns and all your columns are now the rows. So that's how you convert rows to columns in Excel. And with that, we have come to an end of this tutorial. If you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session, or if you require the data set or the resources we used in this session, then please feel free to let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be more than happy to resolve all your queries at the earliest. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.